Hello everybody, welcome back to the workshop. So today I wanted to talk a little bit about my scorpion tail bottle opener. Now, this is a video that I'm hoping you are watching because there are several people, if you have made this in the past, in one of my previous videos for sell, there's been several people complaining that they're not able to open an actual bottle with it or it's not working out. And there is a couple of reasons for that. Now, I can open a bottle with this fairly fine, but it does take a good bit of effort. Now, this is something that I did not have. I didn't have a bottle to actually even try to open uh, in the video. So, this is where it's a good test. It's always good to test your designs uh, before you try to take and sell them to people and things not work out for you. So, we're going to go over a little bit of what it is that this is, and I'm going to zoom you out here in a second and you know show you how it'll open a bottle and where it kind of fails and how we can make it a little bit better uh, for all those that are having some struggles with that because ultimately it's the end product for the customer uh, that we need to concern ourselves with and I want to make sure you guys are successful at this so give me a second we'll zoom this camera out and uh, I'll show you how it opens the bottle currently and then what we're going to do to fix it so here we are We've got the taken bottle right here, um, and this is how that this hooks underneath here. You hook it under like so, and it is a twist to the side, okay? So it's either a twist to the side, if you will, but you take and you grip it like this with your fingers, and you pull up and you pry open the bottle that way. And that is how it's supposed to do. So it hooks with this corner, if you will, it hooks with this little corner here under the bottle cap itself and is used to pry up. The thing in the video is, is it looks like it's meant to actually hook this way, right, and pry up a bottle. But unfortunately, it doesn't do that. Now, this, now that it's already been open, that's not going to help anything, okay? But uh, we can straighten this out. And obviously, this is a lot harder to do, okay? And as you can see, it doesn't quite do, do it, does it? It doesn't quite do it from this direction. And the reason why it doesn't do it from this direction is this tail here actually needs to be up here on the lid itself in order for this to work out. There's a couple of ways that we can actually fix this and rectify this problem. We can take and bend this tail around more, okay? We can bend it around more to where this portion, the fan tail portion, actually sits somewhere in here, almost like a spiral, if you will. Or what we can do is we can actually not only bend this a little bit more, but open this back up a little bit more to move that like that. So this way it opens more naturally as a bottle opener in this direction. Like I said, when I put the design on it, it was to go like this. But again, that I can see where that's a little bit confusing, and I apologize for that in my last video. And again, I can open it, but that doesn't necessarily mean maybe you can open it the same right? So let's adjust this and I'll come back with you after I straighten this up. I'm not going to show this in the video because it's not needed, but I'm going to open this up to where it fits, sits on top of the bottle cap and I'm going to tuck this portion of it in a little tighter and we'll see how that works in comparison. And maybe I'll go ahead and grab a new bottle here. Now uh, this is like a mineral water or something like that. I don't I don't drink, and that's why I don't ever usually have bottles around to test. So uh, I'll get this bent like I'm wanting to show you, and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so here we are. I've got this little bit. As you can see, I added actually more space between there than what I had before, and I also kicked this in just a little bit. So now we should be able to slip that right up underneath the rim of the bottle like so okay and it should open the bottle when we get a good bite on it remember this is a palm this is a palm type bottle opener this is a lot different than like a lever the lever type they're in generally a little better or a little more easier to use uh, for the lever type of bottle openers because you actually have a leverage okay as where this you're counting on the torque of your hand the nice thing about this bottle opener, however, is that you can take and pocket this. You can put it on a key ring pretty easily, as where the longer type 
aren't as easy to take and do that. So you just simply hook it under the rim, grab it in your hand, grab it in your hand like so, okay? It goes under the rim, and just like that, it's opened. So that is how you'll make it. Uh, if you're looking for an easier way of making it, that is the way to actually make it right there. So we'll let you guys get a screenshot of that if you need to. Uh, once again, hopefully uh, not too many people are too mad at me for not making this clearer uh, in that design choice that I had made. It might have been a poor design choice uh, for the beginner as it wasn't abundantly apparent to open the bottle this way versus this way. So anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video nonetheless. Let me know what you thought in the comment section down below. Hopefully you guys uh, will sell a boatload of these and uh, it will bless your business. And like always, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and consider sharing this video around with your friends, whoever it may help. Without further ado, God bless you. And like always, we'll catch you on the next one.